the air in here reeks. And now we start the beginning of chapter two. Uh, I'll try to get as much, as far as possible in here. Uh, if not, it's fine. Uh, let's see. Uh, inventory battle settings. Now it's fine. Uh, party, Mr. Cloud Strife. Resistance. Okay, it's not bad. Uh, inventory. So no optimization options just yet. Yeah, what is that? I've never smelled anything so foul. <laughs> oh, it's me. I gotta do something about that. And soon. Damn bigs. I felt that one in my guts. They just keep on coming. We need to get out of this place. Was it the Mako density? The primary explosive? The blasting agent? Hey, we can figure that out later. <sighs> I'm running on empty here. You can refuel at the base. Next time I'll have to bring a little pick-me-up. Chest right there. Hold on there. How much farther do we have to go? Not far. Good potions. Not bad. That's about as good a place as any. Stand back then. I'll set the bomb. Can't wait to see you, Marlene. Can't wait to take a hot shower. She's good to go. Let that be a Let's lesson to anything that gets in my way. In here. I always gotta make sure. Final Fantasy always has like little nooks and crevices where. Attention, all citizens. Oh. Attention, all citizens. This is an alert from the Shinra Emergency Operations Center. Unidentified intruders have detonated a bomb inside Mako Reactor One. Multiple explosions have been confirmed, as well as ongoing fires. In response, a disaster warning has been issued in sectors 1 and 8. Structures in the area are at high risk of collapse, rendering the entire sector hazardous. Therefore, all residents of the No. No way. This couldn't have been us, could it? Oh yeah, it was. But what if it was? What's done is done. <laughs> Merck's right. It ain't pretty, but we can't stop now. This was just the first reactor, and the planet won't be safe till we get the rest. Yeah, we always knew this was gonna get messy. And this is only the beginning. Y'all gotta look at the bigger picture here. Nothing worth fighting for was ever won without sacrifice. Though you may not be crying out, I know you're in pain, just like the planet. But it's okay, cause I'm here for you That's to it. help take the load off your shoulders and your arms, your fears, your worries, your concerns, and yes, your fears. Whatever your problem, I got you. Uh -huh. hmm. So, what's our next move, boss? That's easy enough. We get our asses home! Sector 7, baby. This looks so much better than the, PS than the PS4 version. Alright, let me go grab a drink real quick. I'll be right back.
All right. Back in action. I'll probably finish chapter two. I forgot that chapter two is actually relatively straightforward. Uh, I think it's until chapter three where you get a little more uh, freedom and you can actually play, um, like you have a hub world. This is mostly gonna be linear, but that's Later okay. Then. Where's my money, dog? Hey, I'd like my money now. You can have it once we're back at base. you what this is, right? Of course not. It's healing materia. You can have it for saving my life. Just doing my job, nothing more. Yeah, yeah. Fact is, I'm lucky you were there. <clears throat> Survival can be a matter of luck or skill. And you can't rely on luck. Words to live by. <laughs> I love Jesse. Yeah. Well, thanks. You do know how to use it, right? You do know what I was, right? All right, so let's do a tutorial in case anyone has never ever done this, right? So you can set material to your weapons and armor. Try setting the healing material. So let's do the bit. So you can set uh, material to weapons and armor through material and equipment. So there's now a new menu that opens up. So we can open it, and then we can set. Then we can set material. Uh, with squat, with triangle, right? So the slots in the top, on the top row, are for your weapons, bottom for your armor. So different armors and different swords or weapons for every character will have different kinds of uh, material slots. So some are joined together, right? And some are individual. The joined together ones, you can actually do like advanced, like more advanced stuff. Um, and this is straight ripped straight out of the original game. Uh, each material levels up separately. So if I have a healing material with Cloud, right, it's not going to be the same healing material that I have for ba for Barry, and vice versa. So they all have to be leveled up by just using them on the weapon uh, for the time being. So, uh, so as you level them up, you'll get more abilities, right? So like the first ability of the healing material is Cure. Then you'll get Cura, which is just a higher version of Cure, then Regen, which will be like a regeneration spell of health rather than just like a bl uh, blank amount. And then you'll get Kuraga, which is like the highest level of healing spell uh, for the time being. So the material is now set. Materia set to your equipment allows you to use new spells and abilities and also boost your stats. Find a combination that works best for your battle strategy. Right? So we can see here, right? Fire, right? You and each. As you can see on the top, it'll say AP, so they, they will all uh, gain XP, basically, uh, over time. So you can customize char your characters uh, in that way. And obviously, you can equip different things, uh, but right now I don't have anything to equip, so. Okay, I was only trying to help. Oh, before I forget, here's a little something extra for being so brave. That really was the ride of a lifetime. Well, see you on the train. Yeah, you're all gonna get squished. Gil is money, uh, in case anyone's wondering. Yeah, so it, I mean, it was, a, it was a terrorist attack. Like, what, what else can you say about this? Careful up 
here. Oh. This could collapse at any moment. If you want up, you'll have to use those stairs. Cool. Thank you. Where's Dad coming? Where are you, Mom? Can you hear me? Where's that stretcher? Where are you? No dice. It's a shit show over there, too. Keep pounding If you really want to get to the station, you can always climb those stairs. Try picking your way across the rubble. That. So Shinra Electric Power Company, that's what it was. I should be running into enemies at some point in time here. Station's intact. He members. Nibelheim. We'll see a lot more of him. That's Sephiroth. Oh, hi. Seth. The hell? I just want to talk. Wait. Don't you fucking walk away from me. real you're dead I am I killed you with my own <gasps> oh you need not remind me it was the crowning moment of our time together but that was then and this is now I have a favor to ask our beloved planet is dying slowly silently Can you bear to see the planet suffer? Cloud. Were the planet to die, so many things will be lost. Your hometown burns so bright. The sound of her voice, pleading for me to 
despair, the shiver of her flesh yielding to cold steel. That which binds us together would be no more, and I would be loath to live in such a world, which is why I must ask you this one favor. Don't worry, it's a simple thing. Run, Cloud. Run away. You have to leave. You have to live. You bastard! Good, Cloud. Very good. Hold on to that hatred. I'm seeing things. Fumes from all the Mako, maybe. All right. You got this. Well, we walked through all this rubble. Uh, yeah, that was Sephiroth. Uh, in the original game, I mean, it's it's almost 30 years. Uh, he's the main antagonist of the game. But here, the, things are being rewritten as we, as we go. So it might not be a one-to-one -one reflection of the original game, and I mean, obviously, it's like the game is you know beautifully remade. Uh, but there, it's called remake for a reason. It's not just like an actual remake. They they change the story a bit. There, there's things that will be changed. No, not again, please no. What did we do to deserve this? Nothing. To believe in Shinra, they'll, they'll make it all better. They're all dependent on the on Shinra itself. It's kind of sad. Welcome to. Uh, you're basically a terrorist, right? Like, you know. Nope. Looking around, trying to see if there's anything I can use. Of course not. Let's go up here. Wow, that blew up like a piece of shit. Do what you like. I'm taking the kids to safety. Loveless Street. Hello. Don't let the intruder escape. Security's everywhere. Okay, so I can't go through there yet. Uh, which means that we are going to go meet the flower girl. Right there. For you. Huh? A flower? That's right. It's a gift. You know, for scaring those things away. What things? Never mind. Think of it as a memento. Just my luck. I heard that, you know. Huh. 
How much? Well, that depends on the customer. In your case... <laughs> it's on the house. Huh? Lovers used to give these when they were reunited. <sighs> Look, I'm involved in things. Dangerous things. Oh, I'm sure you are. So? So keep your distance. Wait, you think someone's out to get you? Is that what you're all worked up about? Relax. No one's going to attack you. I promise. Hey, a Mako reactor just blew. You shouldn't be out here trying to self- <gasps> So that obviously it just increases my HP, which is nice. So we take a look, right? So I could swap any of these for the HP up material. So see, it, it will boost your uh, your HP by X amount. So any character that has low HP, it's nice to put HP up. Gentlemen. Let's go. Ah, uh, that. Wait, hold on. Deadly dodge. Yeah, I need a. I need better armor so I can put some of these on it. She went this way. Is there anything over here? There should be like at least a chest. I just stuck. <laughs> That bastard couldn't have gotten far! Stay alert! Don't want to stick like around you. here. High potion. So this is just a better potion. I believe it's like a boss fight here? If I recall correctly. 
Gentlemen. It's over. Let's do this. So long. Traitor. Sorry. Oh, that was a medal? I don't even remember that one. Uh, flower is... Hold on. Flower wrist guards. Uh, wrist capable of drawing out power that lay down to wear his body. Increases strength by 5%. Yeah, I'll look like that. I at least hit a little hard. Boss, uh, but it was. Don't let him get away, no matter what. Let's look around here. Let's make sure that I'm not missing any chests or anything. I don't use any of my grenades. <laughs> Over there. Oh, what the fuck? Open fire, shoot to kill. Oh, what? Nah, nah. Whoa. Oh, cool. Be advised, target 
Iron Bangle. An arm, an arm, arm man crafted from iron. A sophisticated accoutrement uh, with with a reasonable price tag. We need that, and then we are going to set material. And then we're gonna put deadly dodge. Deadly dodge is probably one of the best materials to have in this game. Uh, and just so like. So what it does is that uh, the attack command will do uh, an area attack immediately after dodging. So it's very nice for like cover covering for area control. Okay, well we got nowhere else to go. Don't underestimate him. I'm waiting. <laughs> That's that. <laughs> It's over. I still got it. Not bad. You 
Nothing to it. Last section. This cloud won't be joining us after all. No need to assume the worst. I'm sure he's fine. You saw him in action, didn't you? Guy's a soldier. Goddamn one-man army. Hmm. You think he's a keeper? Public security to run around. That's what. Had to draw them away from the station somehow. Nicely done. Well, can't argue with results, huh? <clears throat> what? <sighs> Hmm. 
Wait. Hmm? Got a question for you all. What? Ever been attacked by an invisible enemy? Uh, what? <laughs> Wearing robes. Came and went like the wind. <laughs> Thought they were invisible. They were, at first. Only saw them after she grabbed me. A new Shinra weapon, maybe? <laughs> More like a panic-induced hallucination. <clears throat> Never mind. Forget I said anything. Suit yourself. Come on, let's move up. A lot of people here. And in the freight car, too. Because of the evacuation order, maybe? Lucky this us. We've got a crowd to hide here. Head for the front of the train and hold there. Let's Due see. To an explosion oh. at Reactor 1, an emergency schedule is now in effect. Your understanding and cooperation is appreciated. Okay, so let's just, just finish up here. Alright, so let's go up to the train car. Just want to get home. Yeah, yeah. I just wanted to play with you. What is it? Other reactors. Stop that right so now! Man, man, everyone's on edge. Of course they are. Hey, Cloud. I am. Um, no thieves If you're about to unburden yourself, don't. Should have gone to Sector Three instead. You don't make it easy. Stop that right now! I'm gonna have nightmares about those fires. Hey, got a sec? You see, my daughter now lives in You're, Sector 8. Uh, so holding up pretty well, huh? Alone, all right? Even after what we saw at the station and all over Sector 8? I'm a soldier. Well, Why my hands are still hit, shaking. Buddy? You get used to it. Something to look forward to. Or maybe not. Do you think Wu ties to blame? Little help, Cloud, please. I'm sure, Sector Seven's affected too. Nah, Shinra wouldn't let that happen. I can't stop thinking about it. The bomb I made shouldn't have produced an explosion that big. It doesn't make any sense. The explosion triggered a reaction with the Mako. You said so yourself. That was my first guess, but shouldn't the reactor have fail safes to prevent that kind of thing? <laughs> you mentioned invisible enemies back there, right? Right. Oh, no. I'm just looking for excuses for something that was clearly my own fault. <sighs> Gotta own up to it if I'm gonna learn from this and move on. Thanks, Cloud. You're a good listener. Maybe some Am I? rounders did it as payback. Don't be oh stupid. no. Yeah, the slums need. What kind of maniacs would go so far as to bomb a reactor? <sighs> They've yet to announce it publicly, but I heard it was Avalanche's doing. Really? Aren't they the terrorists who tried to kill the president? Is there nothing they won't do? Hey, quit talking out your ass. Everyone knows Avalanche only cares about saving the planet. Hmm? Just, just who do you think you are? A law-abiding concerned citizen. Law-abiding? Really? Mm. <laughs> uh, uh, shh. In my humble opinion, that explosion was a message. A message to the bastards bleeding our planet dry. Think they got it? Heard it loud and clear? Y'all's masters? We will not submit to intimidation or violence, but work together for peace and prosperity. That is how civilized people change the world! Yeah, sure, dude. That's right! That is the Shinra Creed! <laughs> Them spiking words. It's what we believe. We all have to follow our conscience, don't we? We should go. Right. <laughs> It's just a sword. I didn't hear 
big ass sword. Baron. Can you like not scare me? that suit. Shinra creed my ass. We're the good guys, damn it. I find visual aids make the dull stuff a lot more bearable. If it helps, think of it as an initiation rite. How many times do I have to tell you people? I'm not... <clears throat> There's such a thing as playing too hard to get. So, here we've got a wireframe model of the great city of Midgar, complete with massive steel plates suspended 300 meters above ground level. Atop which stands a shining beacon of civilization. The whole system is sustained by the Mako reactors, which feed the insatiable appetites of the public. The train will be passing through an ID uh. checkpoint shortly. This here is the train's route. As you can see, it'll take us around this main pillar. Look, we're about halfway through it now. They've set up a checkpoint here to scan the IDs of all passengers heading in and out. Date of birth, residential status, criminal history, all that and more is automatically cross-referenced in their databases. Public security wouldn't have it any other way. Heads up. <sighs> Don't worry. Our IDs are impeccable. what I tell you? Have a little faith. Won't be long till we reach the bottom. Relax. Take a good look. It's because of that great big pizza in the sky that people down there got to struggle to survive. Shinra sucks up Mako while the soil turns to dust, the air fills with smog, and the flowers die. Then leave and don't look back. <sighs> that's what's always worked for me. <sighs> well, that's all well and good. If you only out for yourself. But the folks down there don't have the luxury of choice, you know. Probably gonna be a good stopping point because uh, it's it's kind of late. Sweetheart, don't worry, I'm fine. Oh, you're goodness, <laughs> knew it couldn't be that bad. No way. <sighs> Hot damn, we are good. <laughs> Bombs detonated one, members lost zero. And one step closer to a brighter future. Hell yeah! Guys! Lower your voices, huh? People are listening. Oh, God. Ah. Ah. Hmm. Now get some r, &R. You've earned it. Just be ready for the next mission, all right? Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> See you soon. Uh, at Seventh Heaven. You know where Tifa works. Don't keep her waiting. She'll worry. Well, and that was chapter one and chapter two. So not bad, right? And I'm glad that you can save on the fly. Uh, that that's actually really nice. Uh, so yeah, uh, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll be streaming and recording the rest of uh, the playthrough for this. Um, so chapter 3 is actually a little longer, so chapter 1 and 2 are more introductory. Uh, but you guys got the gist of the system and everything else, so obviously upgrades, purchases, and yada yada yada, things will get a lot better. I'm already level 10, I mean max level is 50, so um, again, thank you guys again. See ya!